Hi folks, today I'm going to show you how to speed up and clean your Mac. There are several factors that can slow down your computer. Too many applications open at the same time, too little RAM, and of course, the tons of duplicates that waste space on your hard disk. Therefore, the first thing you should do is quit all open applications. One thing that you might find useful is to restart your computer regularly. Some applications, even after quitting them, still take up memory. Only a restart of the computer can bring that memory back. To delete the duplicates, you definitely need some software to do the work for you. You can't even think about doing it manually. The software I use is TidyUp. It's the best duplicate file finder for Mac you can find. It's the fastest, most featured, and it's easy to use, too. You can download it from www.speedyourmacup.com and try the free limited version. Once opened, this is how it looks. To perform a search, you only need to select the type of duplicate you'd like to find. There are searches for music, photos, folders, also for emails, movies, and PDFs, and many more. The search locations will be automatically chosen. You can change them or add any other location by clicking on the Edit button and dragging the new location if it's not already listed in the sources. The search locations can be any folder or mounted disk, the iPhoto, iTunes, Aperture, and Mail libraries. You can switch to the Advanced mode and select your own criteria to perform pretty much every kind of search you can imagine. I'll search for duplicate photos as an example. The result will open in a new window that looks like this. TidyUp offers several ways to visualize and organize the found items. You can decide to use the smart box system to quickly gather the duplicates of a certain type, and you can visualize the items divided into groups of duplicates, or in a full list, or grid of the found items. One thing I really like about this program is that you can easily obtain the found items information you can quick look them or hit the preview button. This will show some more information and a full preview of the item, including the entire location path. The auto check button gives you a few options to quickly select the items to delete, such as auto check, select all the oldest items, or select all the newest items. Alternatively, you can go manually through each group if you need to gather the duplicates more selectively, you can create a new smart box from this button and an option window will appear containing specific criteria for every kind of file. For example, you can decide to gather all the images that are not in the iPhoto library. Once the duplicates have been selected or a box has been created, you can delete the items, move or copy them, back up and burn a CD, export the found item list, or substitute the items with aliases. This is all part of the safe deletion system TidyUp is provided with. This application is able to restore all the deleted items even after the restart of a computer, unless the trash is empty. So, if you are interested in trying this application, go to www.speedyourmacup.com and download it for free.